Welcome to the Nine Show. This is the land where there is constant chaos. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the N I N E Show or the Nine Show. The Nine Show. The N I N N E Show. <laughs> I got my my shoulders are so wide I can't even fit in the screen. <laughs> Actually, yeah, sometimes I really feel like I'm dumber than myself. Technically, it's because you suck. Yep. <laughs> but that is like, true. Like, I don't know what to say. Um, <laughs> I like how you're like hitting yourself on the head <laughs> when you're trying to. Yeah, I'm like, think. I'm like, fuck. Like, we literally we think the same. And we're live. Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome to the Nine Show. And today we're going to be talking about stereotypes and you know MBTI stereotypes and seeing if they hold to be true or not. Um, so who's going first? Are we ready? All right. So I'm going to just share my screen, and uh, we're going to look go. up some INFJ INFJ memes. Yikes! Let's. Are go. we ready? Are we ready? Yeah. All right. What am I doing? Am I saying if I relate to... So what we're going to do is we're just going to take a look at some here, some INFJ memes, um, and we're going to look at them and just tell us what you think. Can you see my screen? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. You're going to have to open that, though. Starting really yeah. That. I'm opening up like this. My sensory is not good enough. Bro. Oh, how do you full screen this one? There you go. I got it. Yeah? Is that big yeah. enough? I've, I've decided you can zoom. to... Can you zoom in That's on good. that at all? How's you could click I can re- I can I can read that though. Like that's my sensory is good enough to read that. No. Um. It's good. It's good. All right. Sweet. Yeah, it's fine. When someone trips the SE wire, an INFJ rage takes over your being. I have decided to scalp you and burn your village to the ground. That sounds like a very um, FI, masculine FI thing, to be honest. Yeah, yeah, and like also. Um, um cat energy yeah very energy. It's, it's funny you say yeah. that because her name is actually cat in real life that actor anyway next uh when you realize <laughs> you can <laughs> connect with practically anyone but hardly anyone can generally connect with you, so you no feel, that's a thing man i do you definitely feel like feel an invisible that. three-year-old boy yeah yeah i do feel pretty childish inside do you like, relate to this as well when you realize yeah i do for sure, for sure. Why? Okay. Next. Okay. You want to be an INFJ because it's rare. Or be an... Oh, my God. <laughs> you want to be an INFJ because it's so rare? Please explain how being overly sensitive with turbulent emotions and walking contradiction whilst being very private and idealistic in today's world is so much fun. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I am overly sensitive, but... I don't capitulate to them. So if, if I feel like I'm emotional in a situation, part of me will just be like, oh, that's stupid. Yeah. And then I'll try, I'll just like not deal with my emotions, <laughs> just carry on with my life. Yeah, uh, and you're, you're more of a, you, you, ha- you do have demon, thinking, uh, demon feeling in a sense. Yeah, yeah. Even though you are an sure. IFJ, because you're a weird one. Um, yeah, yeah. You're missing that FE. You have that lack of FE. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So I am overly sensitive for sure. I think... But um, I don't think you're turbulent with emotions though. Yeah, I'm not quite turbulent. But like if someone criticizes me, I try to take it in as an objective way as possible. But like yeah. internally, like <clears throat> I'm, I'm destroyed. Oh, wow. Okay. But like, but I do, I, I take it on my chin objectively. I don't take it personally. Yeah, sure. It's just, That's good. I'm... <laughs> Double deciding. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah. No, All right. What's that's, next? Uh, that's it. When you're busy, but someone is in need of sharing their life story with you. Yo. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. I, I feel that. Even I, I feel think, that. Oh is this God. a savior tea? Is this a savior tea thing? I don't know. Like, I don't know. How, I, I, I feel guys? like this I is like, like demon, demon tribe. Effie. Demon tribe. Demon, demon Effie. Demon, demon tribe. Like for demon sure. Demon tribe. Yeah. <laughs> Yikes. No, right. my, my we've got two I more. Do, I do it all the time. Two more. I swear to God. Hate two it. more. Type differences in a meme. INFP, life equals pain. Puberty hits hard. <laughs> Basically, a special snowflake. INFJ, oh, wow. Messiah complex. 
a hundred percent moral and a hundred percent vegan and basically Jesus. I don't think I'm either, man. Do you have the Messiah um, complex? Do you have like this I, feeling like you're like destined to like achieve something amazing in your life? Not, not in terms of like being superior, but I, I do believe in my potential, but not in a, not in a, I'm always right. I'm walking the right. Not in a, not in a heavy, uh, like lead FI masculine kind of way, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah I feel like yeah. this should be on the left. Like all this stuff here should be on the left. Yeah. <laughs> INFP. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. All right. One more. And then we'll go to think of, I've already seen this one. Every time you ask an INFJ, even the simplest question, they're like, <laughs> that's just, this that's is true for you, dude. You. Yeah. This is sleep. It's, for you, it's, dude. it's Especially, true for me, but it, it's, it's cause of sleep, man. It's NITI dude. That is, de that's a perfect description of NITI right there. I come off so retarded sometimes. If someone will say something really simple and rather than just answering straight away, I'll think of the five different interpretations they could mean by that. And like, I'm there like processing it and I should just say, the answer straight away but like so i just come off a bit like stupid sometimes but let's go all right uh, aziz aziz not aziz he corrected your last video bro <laughs> i know no it's it's cool it doesn't matter <laughs> i'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> all right aziz yo that was a clear difference Aziz. between masculine si and feminine si uh -huh. like John yeah. was correcting. I kind of, I kind of, cr okay, I'm gonna be honest. I kind of cringed when Jonathan said that. Like, I knew you were joking, but like something, like it just felt so wrong. <laughs> like, oh my god, <laughs> don't do that. Yeah, that's so funny. Don't control me, but I'll control you, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. What goes on in the mind of someone, Asterix, dealing with an ENTP? So the, the example here is an INFP, and he's like, he's turning into like. 1990s 3d with the red and green after all a it's, murder is only an extroverted suicide <laughs> he's so he's so tense that he's face shifting do you get this dude does it relate to you yeah yeah it's like <laughs> it's like they want to kill me and i, I get that i want to kill myself sometimes Stop <laughs> saying that, dude, man. Oh, man. <laughs> dude, it's just my generation, dude. We ate Tide Pods, dude. Like, and I'm still here. So, <laughs> I'm just riding the way of natural. Yo, sports. yo, did you? No, I didn't. <laughs> Not yet. Oh, man, anyway. you missed out. I'm just waiting for the next big trend. Like, I couldn't do Area yeah. 51 because that's just too expensive. <laughs> but like the next one, maybe the Birmingham one. Palace. Um, <laughs> Have you seen Volume or, 51? Or the Vatican. The sorry. Have you seen Volume 51? It's like Area Fifty One, but it's it's a cube. Yeah, yeah. It's um. That's actually that's actually right below it because it, it extends into the third dimension. Yes. So it's, just, it's just it's just the basement. Are <laughs> we're talking you about hungry, you we're talking about a meme. <laughs> talking about a meme. Anyway, all right, dude. Volume Volume Fifty One. Do you do you relate to this meme? MBTI types yeah. as memes. I. You I like offending I, people. Yeah. I it's not that I like offending people, it's just that I'm not the uh the the meme INFP that was like a few ones ago. I'm I'm not I'm not a snowflake and I can like if somebody calls me out on my on my belief, I can sort of make fun of it like like for example I have I have a knee injury and, and lots of people make fun of me about that and like if I know that it's in jest, then it's like haha, you know, I'll laugh with you because it's like the intention matters in that scenario. Yeah, you know? yeah. And so yeah. it's it it is also the case that like you know, you're going to be like that that one person who like always gets um roasted in the in the comedy uh you know, uh clips where the comedian from the stage roasts one of the one of the uh virtue signaling uh audience members. Yeah. Uh yeah. because you just you just can't you can't find humor in something. It's like rape isn't funny. It's like you're right, it's not funny. It's hilarious. Now shut up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> oh, All right. Yikes. Do you have um overdue invoices, dude? Hold on. I will actually tell you. I have two thousand four hundred and fifty-five unopened emails. Wow. Fucking hell. Wait. Let me see if I can beat that. Guys. That's some sensory right there. Some right. facts. Yeah. At one point, I. 
because for some reason I didn't have my phone over the weekend. I was in a group chat and I woke up or rather I got my phone back and I opened it up to uh, over 600 messages. And I'm like, I'm not reading all that. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Did you say you have 2,500? Yeah. Boy, I got 6,000. Wow. Okay, yeah, but you're, you're also older than me, so shut up. <laughs> yeah, this is true. That, what you just said there, Asisk, is perfect to like this meme right now. Dude, that's <laughs> totally what... Odom is peacocking by saying that. I'm not controlling. I'm not organized. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I'm really not. I'm actually quite bad with my organization. <laughs> Oh, when it comes. Right. All right, next one. It's so predictable, and I <laughs> pay attention. All right, any ENTP ever? When did you become an expert on this subject? <laughs> Last <laughs> night. Yeah, because <laughs> yeah, well, I didn't base. sleep. Because he just did his sleep. consume. He did like a, a thirty-minute yeah. consume, and now he's an expert. Yeah, I did sleep awake instead of actually asleep. <laughs> <laughs> sleep awake is the best type of sleep, man. Right. All right, one more. One more. Uh, the ENTP All starter right. pack. Be the, <laughs> the first one. Now, later. <laughs> what society thinks I do? A sincere apology to all victims of my social awkwardness. What my boss thinks I do. Can't someone else just do it? That's, <laughs> that's, that's, that's t typical of a blast last, no? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's just blast last. What 16 personalities thinks I do? Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's true. DJ one. But you legit did debates, right? Like you actually did debates. Yeah. I, I was in debate class for a little bit, yeah. Yeah. And this one here, this this what I think I do is also very accurate. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's good. It's because I'm always spending like like I remember we were talking about this one time. Leon was like, I bet you'd be so easy to start startle with your feminine sensory. And I'm like, I'd have to be paying attention. Like you'd have to bring me out of my head while startling me to be able to actually invoke some sort of reaction. You have to oh, slap the cease to scare him. Oh shit, don't do that. Boom! All right, Leon, you're up, man. Okay, um, it's gonna be hard. Let's get I it. can't even read that, so I'm going to the next one. Yeah, you have to read those to me. INTJ, created specifically to overcome hope and emotion with logic and reason. Nah. You're, you're, other, yeah, guy, kind of <laughs> you're a special INTJ as well because you're, you're you're a lovable guy. Man. You're a feeler, overthinker. Yeah. Thanks, man. <laughs> yeah. No, but I'm pretty logical. I always yeah, beat sure. me about of her uh -huh. reasoning. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Totally, yeah. that is. Yeah. Just to disclaimer, <laughs> I don't actually beat my woman. I just pretend I do. Uh-huh, yeah. With words. <laughs> He's all hay from the right. background. Oh, look, this one's relevant. Okay. This one's relevant. INTJ romance. Forgive me for taking up so much of your time. I don't know what that really... I, yeah, like... Because he was so busy beating them up. <laughs> wow. I talk too much, man. Yeah. I, I talk too much. Ah, uh, you talk too much. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Maybe. Next. INTJ stare. You look like a doggo. That look of pure yeah. analyzing coupled with slight, uh, what does that say? I can't read it. Sad, sardonic, sardonic smile. smile. That makes people uneasy. Yeah, that's a thing, Leon. That's you, man. I have a lot of faces that make people uneasy and most of them I'm not trying to make. I yeah. remember when, when, when my girlfriend Nika first met me, um, she was telling me like, a couple months later, it's like, oh man, like you look like you just wanted to avoid everybody. And you know, you had all these thoughts, but you weren't telling anybody and you look mysterious and angry all the time. And I'm just like, I am angry all the time. <laughs> 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 Judging the heck out of everybody and everything. But accept him in love. As Christ Amen. told me. Amen, brother. All right. Next one. INTJ. Oh, Pointless meetings where extroverts practice pointless words and introverts introverts create solutions. Isn't that this call? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, are you saying this is pointless, bro? Um, no comment. Fuck you. <laughs> like, quit feeling my thunder, guys. This is about me right now. No, I'm yeah. Sorry. <laughs> okay, sorry, sorry. No, um, that statement is kind of weird. Like, because I don't need meetings that are large to have like anything productive happen. And I also don't like long meetings. 
things like that. But if it's going to be a party, then have as many people as you want. Like, that's cool. <laughs> Hell some, yeah. Some IFP made this meme. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> INTJ, you're in my spot. Dude, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that helps so much. Hit the button. Like, you're breathing my air and in my face, in my bubble. Oh. Like, you're too close, man. And you're, oh. if you're in my chair, like, if you take my chair, if I, like, go somewhere to, like, sit, I mean, to go get something real fast for someone else, I'm like, oh, yeah, I'm doing a good deed. Like, I'm probably going to have something good happen to me. And then this guy comes and sits down in my chair, and I'm just like, yo. I'm going to, like, deny myself right now. I've got to put death to this flesh before I put death to someone else's flesh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah bro wow <laughs> that routine you need your spot all right what if i told you intj is really just short for mild asperger's syndrome asperger's syndrome mild what i didn't hear that asperger's As- asperger's oh. asperger's oh, shit. It was this australian accent asperger's asperger's I've, I've... Okay, well, I do have a friend with Asperger's syndrome, and I see a lot of similarities in that. Um, could be. <laughs> okay, not it's really. I think the closer you are, I think the INTJ are. spelling narcissism at its best. Okay, so we got a little thing here. What's your writing? And this guy's like, "Ah, oh, suicide note," and he's like, "Oh, thinking about it, you misspelled useless." Dude. <laughs> Okay, I did something really, really bad to a friend one time because I have a friend who had like an ATV accident when he was like 13. So half his facial muscles don't work. So his eyelids are already closed. And he was crying one time. And I was like, wait a second. Are you crying out of both eyes or one eye? <laughs> you asshole. And he at me, I was like, oh, dude, I can't believe I said so that. Wow, dude. Oh. That's so mean. I like genuinely wanted to know. I wasn't trying to mock him or anything, but oh. I was like so badly wanted to know. You're trying to NT it, like, dude. Too much NT. You're trying to work it out. Yeah, man. <laughs> All right, one more. Savage. One does I'm not kidding. simply tell an IT- INTJ that you're not plan enough. That's dude. you, bro. Like Ooh. everything. That's dude. You. That's in- Oi, like, Leon, I know you've done an awesome job at like planning, like helping our content and stuff, but can you do some more? It's not enough. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you know, I, I hate it when people say, oh, you, you know what? This is the answer to your, uh, your question or like, no, yeah, that's wrong because you haven't thought about it enough. I'm all, do you know how much you know processing what? I've done? Do you know how much writing out and organizing all my thoughts I've done? Do you know what I do to plan my day? <laughs> How productive I am! Like how dare you, man! Oh man! man. Hey, Leon. Yeah, no, I just, I just want to, I just want to respond to that. You know, people in third world countries, they work really hard all day doing manual labor, but they live on less than a dollar a day. So, yikes! So finish your sentence. <laughs> he just, de- he just devalued all your planning. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> Got him. Yikes. All right, my go. That one over my, my head. <laughs> my go. Can you guys say this? Yeah. Okay, so this is an ENFP meme. Let's see. Googling interesting desk jobs for ENFPs. Dude. <laughs> 404. Dude, you know what's so funny? When I finished high school, I, um, I, was, I, went, I went to college, but I was like, fuck this. I don't want to do this. I want to do something fun that I like, actually enjoy. And I literally sat down on Google and I was looking for jobs, jobs where I could be a drummer. I was oh. like <laughs> doing this exact thing. I'm like looking for like drumming jobs. I'm like, I want to like drum for like a stadium or something or like some kind of yeah yeah oh (laughs) dude how the hell did you make it to however old you are like 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 25 (laughs) like you're pretty young pretty pretty young old man you're like you're like you're like six years old like how did you survive like how did you go from i want to be a drummer to i have a i actually have a job and i'm like making money and i didn't starve to death and i'm and i'm in charge of people like and, and, great question. And yes even that that's some that's some good that's a good point <laughs> i think i guess i just like i just grew up and i became mature i'm like you know what if i want to actually live a fun life i need to like own the sensory and the 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 st life i need to like mm. build some solid income and then once i've got a cool thing going on there i can then shift my focus and do creative things and like that's this. how the channel was. How this long is it how, exactly? Yeah. yeah. I don't know. 
it kind of happened. I guess my, I'm, not to go on too much of a tangent, but like my parent, my dad's a very ST. I'm pretty sure he's an ISTJ and he's very like, mm. really kind of helped yeah. direct me. And I've always Yo, had STs around too. me. Like my girlfriend's an ST, my best friend's an ST. Yeah. And these people just like really like help me. Like, you, they're like, you need to sort your shit out and you heard it enough. So, exactly. so you were like, <laughs> actually, no, we can save that for the next episode. All right, moving on. Moving on. Oh, nice dude. Nice. Getting along. Very nice. Thank you. Thank you. All right. ENFP. Creation is, a vi- is vital to their survival. <laughs> yeah literally like just this this couple of weeks personally like i've been doing so much work so much st i've been i've got a full-time job that i work i work after hours on another business and for me like i was i've been going crazy dude and that's why <laughs> i needed to do this channel because i need to be yeah creative. yeah i'm not creative i'm just gonna i'm just gonna like yeah i just go crazy yeah. right so yeah mm-hmm. it's, it's it's relevant when, when are you gonna make a kid when are we gonna make it? <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, I mean that's the ultimate creation, really. That's true. Probably, like I'd say, the next five years or so, when I move to Holland next and I've got years. a bit more, I've got a bit of stability. Once my ST is under control, then I'll make a kid. Dude, are you gonna introduce me to your kid as Uncle Assis? Hell yeah, dude! This is Uncle. Oh my god! Dude. I'm gonna call. They're, they're gonna call oh you Uncle god. Einstein because you're like. <laughs> yeah, but if you, okay, but they have to say it like hardcore, whatever accent, like Einstein, <laughs> like, Einstein, <laughs> Einstein, <laughs> down to the chopper. <laughs> <laughs> wow! Did just Uncle Einstein say hello to him? <laughs> good, man. All right, we next. need to do something with um your accent. Wow. Yeah, maybe I'll use this channel for something like that. <laughs> when cute meets morbid, I'll be dead soon. <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I do oh, I do like dark humor. Like and there's only very specific places where you can actually use dark humor. <laughs> like like here. Not, not at work. Um depending. Alleyways. Alleyways. Well it depends yeah. on if you were like me and you had the chance to work at a hospital. Dark humor is pretty welcome there. Depending oh, on cool. if someone's <laughs> dying or not. <laughs> like actually dying. Yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, so the, the closer they are to death, the better. At least they'll die laughing. <laughs> at, least, yeah, at least they're happy. Yeah, they're dying with a smile on their face. Oh, that'd be so creepy. Their relaxed body with just like that deformed smile. All right, oh gosh, dude. <laughs> that's too vivid now. Is that, is that you? Join All right, what's this? That description? My husband, the extrovert, and I, the introvert, got separated on our flight. We're in the middle seats in the same row. I've already apologized to the people sitting next to me like seven times. My husband is sharing beef jerky with strangers, and I think he's now in someone's wedding. I don't relate yeah, to this. husband's much ENFP. At all. Oh, okay. I don't know. Like, consumed maybe. Sleep. Like, I, I do like sometimes, very rarely, like, I'll just like, be good at like, extroverting on the spot or like putting myself into like another situation that's happening. Um, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. One time I was on a bus um, for this camp at school. There's a whole, there's actually a few different schools in there. This is ra- one random kid and I. We just literally started just singing these random songs in the bus the whole time. <laughs> it was like the most weirdest. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I guess play's technically a demon for you, right? Because it's third. It's yeah, it is. It's technically a demon. It That's is. Crazy. It's, it's, showing up, it's showing up more in my life now that I'm getting older, but it's still, yeah. yeah. It's still not demon. And it's funny because you're an EP as well, but play's a demon. Yeah. It's so interesting. Very interesting. All right. It's like a jump rope. What if I'm really an ENFP? Just in my shadow INFJ because of depression. Is this, was this when you up. were what if I'm was really this when you were INFJ? Just in my <laughs> I don't really get it. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean I, I kinda get it, but I think it's pretty lame. I'm gonna skip it. Yeah, yeah. Straight. That masculine FI, like I don't like it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ENFP. <laughs> I'm not jumping to conclusions. You're just not fast enough. Active for you, right? Yeah. Um, what was that? Like? <laughs> Pretty accurate for you. Yeah. yeah. I like to skip ahead. Like I don't like getting bogged down with like the, the details and the steps. I like to just yeah. kind of jump to the end. Right. All right. See you, you guys. Us, Thanks you... for joining us. See you next time. Bye. <laughs> okay, you you bye. asked us a question earlier, then you answered it. And then, uh, then Leon gave the sensory and you're like, oh yeah, I'm, I was right. You were like, what's mansplaining? Then you're like, is it <laughs> such and such? And then Leon gave the answer and then you're like, oh yeah, yeah I was right.
Yeah. <laughs> I just and directed awesome. it to you, man. And I worked so out, like, with um, the way I like to figure things out, I like to, like, start from the end and then work backwards. Like, I like to see the end goal, and then I'll figure, yeah. out, figure out the details oh, later. Shit. I do that with mazes, because it's so it's easy to just intuition. skim over it. Yeah. All right, one more, and I'm done. Being in a feet. I'm made of glitter, water, and anxiety. Um, the latter, Is that you, bro? Yeah, a bit of anxiety. Not, not, not too much. I don't know about glitter and water. I drink a lot of <laughs> black glitter. Yeah, I'd be, I'd be interested if you were full of glitter, bro. You want to think, Dude. how do you handle anxiety? Um, multiple ways. Normally, I just like, I need to give myself time to zone out on a daily basis. It depends on the day, but... If I'm like stressed out, I'll just like, just meditate like for like 10, 20 minutes, just like throw my phone away. Don't look at a screen, just breathe. And like, just focus on breathing. <clears throat> just yeah. try to be present in the moment. And also there's this other thing which helps. It's like, um, it's a green herb that grows out of the earth. Um, you can, it can be found, it can be found in certain um, um, countries and it grows naturally in certain countries. But uh, it's also, for some reason, illegal in certain countries as well, um, which I'm not sure why. It it's is. pretty stupid because like, it's literally like a, a drug that heals people. But for some reason, the government is like, controlling it and trying to like, reduce access to people being healed because of big pharma and like, all these massive like, pharmaceutical companies which just want to like, pump their drugs into us. Dude, this don't, like, spoil, don't, 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 don't spoil our future episodes. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I just had to do that. Anyway. Oh, man, that was funny. These may or may not be accurate um, opinions. All right, boys. I think we're about done. Who wants to, who wants to sign out? Who wants to sign us out? No, oh, no, no. I'll, just, I'll just straight Fuck up call. Fuck's sake. Right. <laughs> Yo, just end it. Just end it. <laughs> Goodbye, everyone. Yeah, was, I hope you guys have cool. a good life. This Great was, blast this was real. Comments. Great blast. Like, maybe. subscribe. Uh, just like all our videos as well. Please, please um, add comments. Like, we, we, we religiously read all the comments. Um, because yeah. we like to like get feedback from the tribe. We like to be better. We're all growth minded. We have silly Jono's, things to say. Jono's but, peacocking. Um, we're, we're all DI, so we don't realistically we don't care about the tribe. But but <laughs> don't tell them that. But leave us, don't leave tell us them that. some comments. It's a secret, man. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, thanks guys. Like, subscribe. Uh, check us out on social media, on Instagram and Facebook. Um, and please reach out to us because we love to chat to people. Thank you and uh, bye. Bye.